It was a day full of fun and sun and under on the beach of the new South Shore Park. And they had their grand opening today here in Bemidji. Haiti Clotter shows us how the best way to celebrate is with a beach party. It was about 80 degrees outside and the weather was just right for the grand opening of South Shore Park in Bemidji with the ribbon cutting ceremony. Three. The park restoration has been years in the making and construction began in August 2015. We have some historic signage on the building kind of representing all the people that have flowed through this area and have had an impact um, starting with things like the glaciers, the railroad, the Ojibwe culture. Megan Ceballos was at the celebration with her children and remembers what South Shore Park looked like before the restoration. We came here a few years ago before they redid the beach and it was not very nice. And so today it looks wonderful and I think we'll definitely come back. People enjoyed themselves by paddle boarding, building sandcastles or just relaxing. For City Council Member Michael Milhouse, he was happy to see a project he worked on come to life. The park is now just it's hopping right now on a Friday afternoon and I can't wait to see how busy this is going to be this summer. The park was completed in two phases, starting off with the lake bed restoration, which cost about $1.4 million and took a few years. The second was the park project, which cost about $600,000 and was funded through the city and was done in about a year. Guests will have plenty to do, such as a bike ride, go for a swim, or rent out this facility for events. Well, there's just a lot of potential for great activity to be outside exercising and enjoying our natural resource, Lake Bemidji. The goal was to make a place for people to recreate. You can say mission accomplished. In Bemidji, Haiti Quarter, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.